Hey guys, welcome back to the Chef Jeff Experience. Today we're gonna show how to convert rice into fried rice. So a few things you're gonna need. The first thing you're gonna need are three eggs. Then you're gonna need a half a stick of butter. Then you're gonna need some frozen peas, some fresh carrots, and you're gonna need some garlic. And the last thing we'll need is some avocado oil. So we're gonna start by um, cleaning the garlic. Are we ready? Are we ready? All right. So I've already got the uh, I've already got the rice cooking. Now we're gonna take our garlic and we're gonna finely chop it. Good. All right, then we're gonna go ahead and get our carrots and peas cooking. All right, and we're gonna do our carrots and peas in our one quart. So we're gonna take our number uh, two blade. Chop our carrots up on the number two blade. All right, we're gonna take our frozen peas. We're gonna place these in the bottom of the one quart, about like so. go to medium low heat and once you go to medium low set your timer 20 minutes and then the rice will be ready all right so we got our frozen carrots or frozen peas we're gonna put our fresh carrots in here then we're gonna put that on medium when it whistles turn it to low for 10 minutes and these are gonna be for our fried rice So we're preheating, preheating the large skillet on medium high, and then we're gonna do the water bead test. As soon as it beads, we're gonna dump our eggs in, and we're gonna do our uh, scrambled, greaseless scrambled eggs. So I'm gonna go ahead and put these in here. Beating. Are you ready? So we're gonna add our eggs to a dry pan. And then we're just gonna take our square flat spatula. We're gonna reduce this to medium low while we finish the eggs.
There is the scrambled eggs. So we'll set those aside. We are gonna melt half a stick of butter, and then we're gonna add our fresh chopped garlic to that. We're gonna saute it to infuse the flavor from the garlic into the butter. And then uh, by the time we get that done, it'll be time to add our rice, our peas and carrots, and our eggs with a little bit of avocado oil, and we're just gonna fry it up really nice. So, and then we're gonna go ahead and add garlic to that and then we just want to saute that for about two to three minutes just so we can infuse the flavor of the garlic into the butter Okay, there's our rice, perfectly cooked. And we're gonna crank our heat up on here to medium high. All right, and so for our fried rice, we're gonna take our butter with our garlic sauteed in it. We're gonna add our pan of rice to that. Maybe. And then we're just gonna take our metal spatula and we're gonna get, begin to toss the rice. And you wanna hear that nice snap, crackle, pop. And most of the butter has been absorbed into the rice. So we want to add a little bit of avocado oil. I'm going to say about a quarter of a cup of avocado oil. Well, it appears that I got a child proof one. One more. Ah. There we go. Okay. So we're going to add about a quarter cup of avocado oil to this. You want to look, see that brown forming on the rice? That's what we want. We just want to keep folding this in. Then we're gonna add our fresh cooked carrots and peas to it. And our eggs. going to start folding all of the incorporating all of the ingredients into the rice and then we're going to fry this for at least uh, a good 10 minutes 
and I'm gonna go ahead and add a little bit of fresh salt and a little bit of fresh cracked pepper to it. So to finish up our fried rice, uh, the last step is we're gonna add a half a cup of soy sauce. Enjoy. Come on. How we doing? It's peace. Good. The new one for out, right? And then you let your food Good. <laughs> it's always my favorite fried rice. Hey, grazie.